Hi, I'm Stephen Hand. I'm running for Mayor of Ongapringa. Today I want to talk about saving the Hopwood Theatre. Now, you'll see in the photo um, Amanda Richworth, you'll see um, Aaron Thompson, you'll see Nat Cook, you'll see um, Catherine Hillard. All there, all lined up for a big photo opportunity to save the Hopgood Theatre. It's like, yay, we've saved it. Oh, sorry, and there's also our acting mayor, Simon. Now, Hopwood Theatre asked for $5 million to refurbish it. Um, the Labor government gave them $6 because it's like, they're $6 million. So, they're going to redo, I don't know what they're going to redo with $6 million, but they're going to do something. So, right. Um, now, we're also giving SA Country $300,000 a year to manage this theatre. You're probably going to say, well, 300000 seems pretty good, right? 6000 a week? How do we make money in a theatre when the expense of managing the theatre is 6000 a week? I don't know. Now, I'm going to say this theatre is currently used by local dance groups and schools to perform their annual, annual plays or annual dance competitions. In fact, my son's dance school is actually performing there in November. So it's like, it's costing us 6000 a week. How much is the school, how much is the hire of the theatre? I don't know the answer, but I'll find out. How much is the hire of that theatre? Now, a lot of dance companies have said to me, they can't actually afford it because the Hopwood Theatre is too expensive. Now, they also said to me they, that the canteen you can't use, so you can't sell coffees and Cokes and food items that, that the performers and the audience want to have access to when they're using the theatre. Now, if you look at the Hopwood Theatre, you'll see there's not a lot of plays coming on to the Hopwood Theatre for the next year. Um, look, I think this is all stuff that needs to be addressed by council. Someone needs to take responsibility for this and try and get this, the Hopwood Theatre, in a place where it's a community centre, where you've got comedians coming, where you've got um, like com comedy sort of stand up for local um, performers to appear and have prize money, local plays, local theatres, local, local dance competitions. Um, there's a lot that can be done, but when the costs are so high, it's 6000 a week. Now, if you've got two events per week there, which is basically what they're averaging generally, that's $3,000 a night. For a school, for a little dance school, it's a big cost. Well, I when they asked me what I thought of the Hopwood Theatre, I said, look, I want to see the numbers. I want to see the costings. I want to see all the data so I can have some input into it. But it seems like we're all happy to just pile lots and lots of cash into things and say, this is great for, for all the residents of Ongapringa. And maybe it is great. But surely you want to know that your money, your ratepayers' money, and even if the late Labor government, the state Labor government is kicking in six million, that's your taxpayer money. It's coming from your pockets. So if they're kicking in six million, that means taxes, right? So your taxes are going to be increased. Um, you want to see bang for the buck. You want to see stuff that's affordable that you go, well, look, I can see that and that is a worthwhile project. That's what I want to see with Hopwood, that we spend our money effectively that is used. We want to see this theatre used more than twice a week. We want it to be affordable for community groups and we want to get plays and theatre in which are more than just local so we don't have to go into Adelaide. So the, the events that occur in Adelaide occur down here in, in Ongapringa. In fact one of my friends, one of the councillors just running um, for Ongapringa, she was in the city last night watching um, some things I'm like well that could be the Hopwood but anyway I'm Stephen Han I'm running for mayor of Ongapringa these are some of the things I think we need to address costs because we all seem to be so happy just to throw lots of money around now in business you can't do that because you go broke so just give us some thought uh, you can drop comments below anyway I'm Stephen Han thanks for watching bye